Good morning and happy Friday, guys. Today, I'm gonna go pick up my car. My mom should be here in about 10 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my shoes on and wait for her to show up, that way we can leave. My car is ready. I did receive a text from the guys at the tenting place saying that my car was ready to be picked up. I told them that I would probably be there about 11 o'clock. So that is what I'm gonna go do. And then my mom and I are gonna go have lunch and she wanted to go to DSW. Brian warned me, do not buy any shoes. You don't need any more shoes. I'm like, I'm not gonna buy any more shoes. I'm not. Um, my mom's gonna buy some shoes. Because <laughs> I don't really need any more shoes, and I really don't, but you never know. I mean, I might find a cute pair that you just can't resist. I mean, that just happens, right? But anyway, and then we're gonna go have some lunch, and then I'm gonna head back home. But while I was waiting for my mom to show up, I actually filmed my kitchen drawer organization video that I had promised you guys. You guys were, um, you guys said that you guys would like to see. So that is what I did, and then I realized I forgot two drawers. So when I get back, I'm gonna have to add those two drawers into that video because I forgot two drawers. Like, who does that? Um, but anyway, so yeah, so I'm basically waiting for my mom. I'm gonna put my shoes on now, make sure I have my purse, my fan, anything that I need for the day. And then we're gonna get our day started. And I thought I would take you guys along. So I'll see you guys shortly. Bye. Alrighty, guys. So I got my car. I have Mickey back. He's so excited to have his windows tinted. He's so happy about that. But anyway, and it's so nice to have him tinted too. They just look so nice. It's nice and cool in here too. It like keeps less of the, like the sun out and everything. But anyway, my mom is right behind me and um, she is following me over here to DSW, which is over by Bridge Street. And then we're just gonna grab some lunch and just maybe walk around Bridge Street a little bit and then she's gonna go home and, and then I'm gonna go home and get some stuff done there. But for the most part, we're gonna go do a little bit of shopping and enjoy each other for some lunch today. And that's gonna be nice. And this is where I walked yesterday, all the way down right here. And then um, I turned, I think, right around the corner here. The This light is so long. Oh, it's like the, the light down here by rooms to go. Oh my goodness. And it's a Friday and you can tell because traffic is crazy. But anyway, I'm starving, so let's go have some lunch. I think we're gonna go to P.F. Chang's. So, yummy. So my mom's gonna try these shoes on. Oh. Very sparkly camouflage shoes. Ooh, look at the sparkles on those. Mm. I'm a sparkle kind of girl. I know you are. I like to sparkle and shine, Mom. Oh, oh those are actually yeah. very cute. <laughs> yeah. And they're so sparkly. Oh, and they go with my army skirt. They do. <laughs> That would even look cute with a black skirt. Yeah. Those are cute, Mom. Those are <laughs> I didn't come here to get these shoes. But you did come to get flats, though. So, you know, that's part of your flat yeah. collection. That is. That is part of your flat collection. See what's gonna happen is you're gonna come back next week. You'll be like, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back to next week. I'm gonna get those at DSW. I know. Mm hmm. I know you. I know you all too well. You need black ones and ivory ones. I do. And you need those ones. I don't want those. Oh. I only like these. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, then you need to get those, Mom. <laughs> They're very sparkly. <sighs> so pretty. You should get them. I don't know. I just don't know. You should get them. I think we're gonna get these for Lukey. Look how cute they are. <laughs> Little tiny shoes for Lukey. Such a cootie. I like these though. They don't have my size or else I'd, or else I'd get those. No, I wouldn't, but yes, I would. No. Here, mom, you should get these. Oh no, I can't do <laughs> Then you could put a stripper pole in your house and everything with these. Those are pretty. Yeah, those are gorgeous. I know. Yeah, they're definitely very pretty and sparkly, that's for sure. Ooh wee. Yeah, these are pretty. Yeah, those are nice too. Oh yeah, those are pretty color too. Let's 
just for my bed. I don't think you bed. It's for this chair. These are all the clearance shoes back here. Ooh, no, no, no. That's why they're on clearance, because they're ugly. Yikes. Oh, yeah, I don't like any of these. No, 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 no. There's a saxophone player here. Oh, now he's going to stop playing because I'm walking by. Oh, no. <laughs> it sounds so nice. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, yep, they're upside down tree. Oh, look how cool. What's wrong, Mom? Uh oh. They have um all of the Alabama, huh? Alabama stuff, Tennessee. Probably should get our very first. Al well, I have an Alabama ornament, but we should get another one now because we're here. <laughs> I like this one. Yeah, that one's cool. I like that one. Cute. Oh, I like this one too. I like the front. Yep. He's cute. Oh, the chair's cute. I like this one. Yes, that one's cute too. I like them. So obviously my dad is a huge Trump fan, so we found this ornament for him. My mom's going to get it for him. <laughs> and he's going to love it. <laughs> So this is Bridge Street in Huntsville. And if you guys have been following me for a while, you guys know that there's a hotel, the West End, that's down here. And this is where Brian and I used to stay. And then we used to like walk up and down here and shop and do all kinds of stuff. But my mom, we walked into the Christmas store. My mom is buying my dad that ornament. So I'm just waiting for her out here. Woo, it got hot outside in a minute. So my mom and I just walked the entire length of Bridge Street. I got some more stuff at Bath & Body Works because they had their three wick candles, buy one, get one free. So I bought more of those and I'll show you guys when I get home. And then I bought some soaps for the guest bathroom that's navy blue, which is the Jack and Jill bathroom at her house. So um, Brian's parents will have plenty of like hand soap and stuff when they get to the house. So anyway, so that's it. So I'm gonna go. And I'm gonna head home and I will see you guys when I get there. Alrighty, so I am home from picking up my car and having lunch with my mom and just kind of walking around Bridge Street a little bit and we did a little bit of shopping. She did get those shoes, but we did not get those shoes for Lucas because um, my mom had said Lucas's foot is a little bit wider than those shoes. So we need to try to find him some shoes that are wide because he's got a little tiny wide foot. So. My mom says she's gonna go get his feet measured in town and then she'll know exactly what size he needs and how wide. So anyway, so we didn't get those shoes for Lukey, but my mom did get her shoes. And then we walked around, like I said, Bridge Street. I went to Bath and Body Works and that is what I'm gonna show you guys right now what I got. You guys, I know I went to Bath and Body Works like what, two weeks ago and picked up a couple of candles while I was there, but come on, seriously. If you see a Bath and Body Works, you go in, right? And then when they say they have um, three wick candles, buy one, get one free, you get them, right? So that's what I did. And then a couple of other things as well. So let's take a look inside and I'll show you guys what I got. Um, okay, so these were, again, what are these, four for 20 or whatever. So I got four of the same ones. These are the gingham uh, Bath and Body Works like hand soap or whatever. Okay, so my Jack and Jill bed, my Jack and Jill bathroom, which is over here between the two guest rooms, that bathroom is like a navy blue and white. So I just thought these would be so perfect. I did not want to go pick out any more soaps, so I got four of these. Same kind, they're just gonna stay in that bathroom unless I decide to put them in my bathroom. I didn't know, they, they smell nice. So, um, so I got those for the guest bathroom mainly. And um, then I did get the other two candles. Oh, I did get five more of these um, oops, hand sanitizers. Five more hand sanitizers in the beautiful day because these are always good to have. And um, I got five of those. And then I got, so these are buy one, get one free. So I got the gingham candle that is, that matches the hand soap. So I got that. And let me see if I can, with the blue freesia, white peach, fresh clementine with essential oils. And it smells amazing. I mean, it really, really does. 
it smells so good um and then i got so that one i got one buy one get one free the same kind and then of course i got another <sighs> sweater weather this one smells so good too you guys this is like one of my favorite scents sweater weather so i got a buy one get one free of this one as well so i'm gonna actually go put these ouch in my um closet back there in the guest closet because that's where i keep my candles and my soaps actually some of my soaps i keep in my laundry room and then these i keep in my room back there um in my little pull out drawer so i'm gonna go do all that and then i'm gonna put my receipt away because i shared it on youtube it's a tax write-off so just so you know uh I'm gonna go put this in. Say I have to have two of them in the guest bathroom because there's two sinks and two people might use the sink. So like Keith might use one and my mother-in-law might use the other one. So Keith and Chris. Um, so I'm gonna put two of them in there. And then the other two, I will just put up in the cabinet for um, safekeeping. And that my friends is going to be it for the day. Oh, wait, one more thing. So you guys know we're going to Universal in November. And the only, I like going to Universal. I, I have so much fun when we go to Universal. The only problem I have with Universal is the simple fact that they make you put your bags in a locker when you go to ride like the Hulk or um, Rip Ride Rocket or um, Green Gots or something like that. So they, you always have to put your bag. So I always carry a crossbody bag. You have to put it in a locker. I don't know, and somebody can tell me, leave me a comment below if you guys know, do they make you take off your fanny packs? <sighs> it's embarrassing. It's hard to say that I have now reached the point in my life where I'm going to use a fanny pack when I go to the amusement park. If I can avoid having to put something in a locker, this might be my lifesaver. It's not as big as I would like because I do carry a lot of stuff with me when I'm at the, the theme parks, like my camera and an extra battery and chapstick and headache meds and hemorrhoid cream and <laughs> not lying. And what else do I keep with me? I mean, I just keep all kinds of stuff with me. Oh, and and I keep water with me. So that was the reason why I chose this one off of Amazon because it actually has a spot for you to carry water. It's so like a little like pouch where you can carry water. I will put a link to this in the description box below. I will try to remember that. I fail at that every single dang time. I say I'm gonna do it and then I don't do it. And then somebody asks me where the link is and I'm like, dang it, I forgot to put the link in there. Anyway, um, so this is just, it's just a fanny pack. So I'm hoping that it's got enough space to, for me to keep my wallet, credit card, money, cash, whatever the case may be, camera, extra battery charger, chapstick, all the other stuff that I need to carry with me. So I'm gonna try to give this a try and see, but I don't know if they're gonna make you take this off. I don't know if they make you take fanny packs off. I don't know. So if any of you guys out there know, Leave me a comment below and say, yes, they do. No, they don't. You're good with a fanny pack, whatever the case may be. So um, this is by Waterfly. So I don't know. Don't know, but I'm gonna give it a try anyway. But that's it. Okay, so I'm done. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one. Have a great weekend, friends. Bye.